Moral Outrage, Female Discrimination by Caitlin Gonzalez. Women around the world are being discriminated in many different ways. Females compared to men get more discriminated worldwide. Females are said to be more judged easier than males. Also, females aren't allowed to do as many things as men can in some countries. Last, females are judged on their physical appearance more than men. It is unfair today that females are talked about and presented the way they are. Females are humans and should be created and looked at as equal as men are. Female discrimination is an injustice because God wants us to be treated equally. Females don't get treated appropriately in some countries and especially our own. Some examples consist of, in Saudi Arabia, women aren't able to drive. Also in Saudi Arabia, all women must have a male guardian, typically a brother, father, or husband. Also, they have to ask permission for marriage divorces, traveling if they're under 45, education, employment, and opening a bank account. On March 9, 2012, a woman died and 50 other were injured in Saudi Arabia because of their protests about their rights. And previously that year, in September, their king granted women a right to vote and hold political office for the first time. In the U.S., females that work full-time make 79 cents for every dollar men earn despite their educational rates. In Naples, if a woman is raped slash assaulted, the perpetrators are not punished or even arrested. I just want to know where the justice is. Female discrimination generally affects women, but it also affects the way the rest of the world sees them. Women have become vulnerable to men. For instance, in Australia, 33% of women and only 9% of men experience sexual harassment in their lifetime. In the European Union, 40 to 50% of women have experienced sexual harassment in the workplace. And in India, 17% and 95% of women in Delhi feel vulnerable to sexual areas at any time while they are in public. Here are some stats on the employment of women compared to men. Even women who are pregnant are being discriminated. People will less likely hire those who are pregnant or plan on it. People who hire pregnant women will blame them for their work based on their performance and will find reasons to blame her. Women may not get hired for a certain job because of her physical appearance. She will be automatically judged for the clothes she's wearing, her weight, and her attractiveness. Men and women are equal when talking about human dignity. In a Catholic church, antithology sexes complement each other, although many famous slash important roles are males during the Old and New Testament. Women play a major role in motherhood and is mainly known for taking care of children in their homes. Both sexes complement the Catholic church's caregiving. In natural law, the discrimination against females regarding their social status is wrong and to immorally justify a woman is wrong. In the Old and New Testament, a verse from Galatians chapter 3, verse 28 states, There is neither Jew nor Greek, there is neither slave nor free, there is no female and male, for you are all one in Christ Jesus. This Bible verse creates a good understanding of the equality among Jesus. This quote explains that everyone is the same but in different ways. There is no need for females and males to be discriminated and that we are all created by God and should be respected. When females are discriminated, it doesn't come from the heart of God. Female discrimination is a sinful act, and there are consequences regarding it. When someone discriminates against a certain sex, hatred comes from them. It isn't good to have hatred in a moral life.